So back at it on my vehicle, and one thing I want to do is make my engine bay just look a little better along with the interior. Now, I have cleaned it, wiped everything down, but everything's kind of dull and faded. But on another vehicle I had, I actually used this stuff, and it worked really good. And even six months after the fact, my engine bay looked a lot better. I mean, this one, I'm not going to get it perfect because there's a lot of rust and crust. But even using it in my interior, it looked really good. So let me show you what I got. Amsoil Mudslinger repels mud and dirt, speeds cleanup, protects against UV rays, restores color and luster, and this thing works fantastic. So just to kind of give you an idea, now I've already cleaned everything off, gotten off the dust and grime and all that stuff, but this is kind of faded. We'll spray it. Let it sit for a few seconds. Grab me a microfiber towel and just gently wipe it. And it's shiny, it looks a lot better. Now, the longer you let it sit, the better it's gonna work. So let's just give this another quick spray. Let that sit for a little bit. I wanna spray most of the stuff down. Like I said, a lot of stuff is rusty crusty, so we can't get it right. But we can make the battery look a little better, that, the air box, all that stuff. So spray it down and we'll see how much better we can make this look. Radiator hoses are the biggest one that look really good and benefit from this. We'll get the plastics for the radiator. And the stuff smells really good. Alright, let me finish this up and I'll show you what it looks like. Now she's starting to shine up pretty good, but the biggest improvement is gonna be this cowl. Now ideally I like to take them out, scuff them, and paint them, but because of the weather and time, this stuff is going to work great. Get a nice decent coat on it. It'll protect it. And then when we get some time later on, we'll really give it the proper cleaning and attention that it deserves. All right. Let it dry for a few minutes. Wipe it down. And this should look nice. Now for the interior, if you look at this, this is kind of faded and scratched and all that good stuff. So let's get my stuff out of here. Or just put it up there. I'm gonna spray this. Now I've cleaned this several times and let's give it a spray. here same thing with my center console this too get on the dash just everywhere to kind of spruce it up a little bit and let's wipe everything down and we'll see the final result so I've given it about 15 minutes and we're just gonna go ahead and wipe the excess. And it leaves a nice film, but it's not greasy or grimy, which is I kind of like about this. And as you can see, I mean, so much shinier, nicer looking. I mean, yes, this is probably pointless and worthless, but I mean, I like my vehicles to look nice. And why not give it a little shine? You know, treat them right. Or if I was to put this up for sale, you know, it looks good. And like right over here. Nice shine. And the cowl, same thing. It looks way better. I mean, look at that. Now, it's not going to last forever, but it's going to be better than it was and good enough for government work. As you can see, it looks a lot nicer, shinier, 
And if we were to spray paint the valve covers or even the exhaust heat shield and anything else, I mean, this thing will look really shiny. This thing will look pretty good. Now let's go inside. And let's see how this came out. Which is, as you can see, that's a lot better. And when it dries, it gets like a little tacky and the excess wipes off really easy. So this thing is definitely easy to manage. And look at that, look how much better that looks compared to all those scratches. Now, the longest I've seen these things last, well, this treatment last, is about six months. And I had that in my uh, Dodge pickup or my Ram pickup. And it still looks really good. And my recommendation for this would be clean it first, let it dry, and then spray this. Wait 15 minutes, wipe the excess, and as you can see, pretty much brand new. So quick tip, stuff is from Amsoil, not sponsored by them, but it's something that I use to kind of jazz up my car and keep it looking good for a little bit. So thanks for watching, and maybe this might help your vehicle.